Ruth was abused by her father and two lovers before she met Blakely. Ruth was abused by her father and two lovers before she met Blakely. Years later, Ruth's son desecrated. Her grave then took his own life. She told the jury she wanted to kill Blakely. The rival lover who gave her the gun and drove her to the murder scene was never charged. Although it's likely Desmond Cousin was highly involved in the case, he was never charged or investigated. Cousin was fighting for Ellis's affections and was likely her co-conspirator in the murder. Cousin and Blakely were longtime rivals, and Ellis lied to investigators to protect Cousin. Police questioned Cousin, who spent the day with Ruth and her son on Easter Sunday, and he told them that after he dropped them off around 7.30 p.m., he didn't see them again. Ruth told police that an unnamed security guard at Little Club gave her the murder weapon three years prior, but investigators later discovered that Cusson not only gave Ruth the gun, he taught her how to use it and drove her to the murder scene. Cusson confessed to Ruth's lawyer John Bickford, but Bickford chose not to include any of it in Ruth's defense. She shot Blakely in public on Easter Sunday. One of the more scandalous aspects of Ruth Ellis's case was that the crime was committed in public on Easter Sunday. Ellis's lover David Blakely spent Easter weekend building a race car at the home of the Findlaters, an upper-class family with whom he was friends. He refused Ruth's calls during his time away, and when he and Findlater went to a local pub called the Magdala, Ruth lay in wait outside. When Blakely exited the bar, she fired two shots at him. The second hit him, but he was still running, so she fired again. He collapsed, and she shot him two more times. One couple standing across the street recounted what they witnessed. I shall never forget the look of appeal in his eyes. She put two more bullets into him, deliberately. I was petrified bullets were fired from such close range that there were powder burns on his skin. As patrons exited the pub, one woman's thumb was hit by a stray bullet when it ricocheted off the concrete. A police officer visiting the bar arrested Ellie's outside. Hey guys, thank you so much for the support and likes and comments down below. And also thank you so much for watching and I look forward to see you in the next video then. Take care. Bye.